weak defense there. I'm pretty sure that was not and really just unselfish basketball on the interior. That's the kind of pass a coach loves to see. Shumpert passes to Moskov. They set the pick. Back to Shumpert. And count the basket in three of four. This game. In the season ago, they hit about 75% of their free throws. Johnson kicks to Shaq. Oh, went in there and tried to power it down. But true contact, he'll head to the line. That one on Mozgov. He gets right to the rim, but the defense there to deter. I really like that he didn't shy away from the contact at all. I mean, he was determined to get to the basket no matter who was offering the resistance. James up top, guarded by Jordan. Love with the screen on Jordan. LeBron dishes to Love. Wait again, Shumper. LeBron outside. Irving. Another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively so far. Yeah, and I, I think we're going to see them operating a lot of their offense from the interior today. Here's O'Neal. Here's Jordan. Another shot. And the rejection by LeBron. And now the Cavaliers. Fast break. Here's Love. Cut the bucket. The yeah, heads up aggressive play right there. Saw the smaller man on him and took it straight to the basket. And the first time out of the game called for Chicago. Bulls trail by four. Johnson, the pass to Bird. Johnson attacking. Jordan dishes to Wade. Johnson left side. And he tries off the glass, but it's on. Hands it from downtown. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this league. Quality looks they're getting, and they're capitalizing on them, guys. They have to be happy with this start offense. And here's Wade after LeBron James hitting the three. Back to Johnson. Bird outside. O'Neal passes to Jordan. The Bulls need to get a shot off here. Hope they get it back. Can they get it? And it's Shaq laying it in. Shaq's got seven points in the game. They have got to put a body on him because otherwise, with his agility and athleticism, they're not going to be able to contain him on the offensive glass. Timeout is called first of the game for the Cavaliers. Tristan Thompson, he's checked in for Mozgov. Nice Cavaliers leading. Outside Irving. Love with the screen for Irving from deep. And it's Kevin Love with the three. Love's got his second best. That's two straight quick three-pointers they've allowed. Defense just not reacting with enough aggressiveness. Outside Jordan. He dishes it to O'Neal. Puts up a three. They get a hand on it. Leaps for it. Out of bounds. Cleveland takes possession. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Guys, I was able to talk with David Blatt for a minute. We talked about the strategy as it applies to D. Wade. He said Dwayne can score at will when he gets into a rhythm. So our job is going to be prevent him from getting into that rhythm in the first place. Because if we can't do that, the points will just pile up. Most opponents are completely aware of that, guys. Great. Thanks for the report, Doris. Here's Curry following the basket by Kyrie Irving. And Kareem throws it down. And really nothing like a good old-fashioned throwdown to get a team going. And, Greg, they do need to get going. They wouldn't mind, you know, shaving a couple more points off that lead right away. Well, if the defense keeps giving up easy baskets like that, it won't be a lead for long. So it's the Cavaliers now after the Bulls pick up two. Puts it up from 17. It's hauled in by Bird. High-quality shot, 
Just a little off there with the release. And Greg, that has him S H H shaking his head. Tough miss that time. <laughs> And the Cavaliers with some changes. Verishow comes in for Kevin Love. And it's Williams in for Irving. And so here is Chicago. Eight-point game. Good. You know, he'll make you scratch your head and throw your hands up as a defender. I mean, you just don't know how to play. Williams against Curry. Verishow with a screen on Curry. Williams dishes to Verishow. A shot. No good. Now Chicago takes it the other way. And the dunk by Jordan. Wow, fired that bounce pass in there beautifully. There's a minute 40 left in the first quarter. Jordan against James. Thompson sets the pick for James. Offensive rebound. Thompson with the bucket. His hard work on the backboard really just has given them more opportunities to score. Williams against Curry. And here's Bird from the arc. Verizhaw grabs the ball. Well, not really his best quarter as far as scoring. Let, let's see if he can eventually get back on track. LeBron kicks to Verizhaw. And the bucket counts. And he's on his way to the free throw line. Try to make it a three-point play. And, and the game plan is clear. Work the ball inside. And it's working for him, Greg. You like that initiative? Not settling for stuff on the perimeter. Whiteside's checked in for Bird. Whiteside, the pass to Curry. Abdul Jabbar against Verishow. Jordan kicks to Abdul Jabbar. Whiteside, a screen on Thompson. Shot clock at three. Jordan. Can't hit. Good D by LeBron. Boy, blew the easy two by profile. Trying to look good. That's a bad decision and poor execution. Williams dishes to Thompson. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. And no doubt they've come into this game with a really aggressive approach. Just pounding the ball inside. It certainly is working. They're finding the open lanes to the hoop and owning this game early. And the shot is good. Shots are just flowing for him right now. Having a really strong quarter. LeBron up top, guarded by Jordan. Now LeBron kicks it to Williams. Puts up a three. That misses. Would have counted had it gone in. No shortage of scoring here at the end of the first quarter. Cavaliers on top, up nine. It's the NBA on 2K Sports from... Welcome back. It's been all one-sided so far through the first quarter as our second quarter gets underway. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Cavaliers. You know what, guys? It looks to me like they're really in sync here, all on the same page. They've already got a bunch of assists. Yeah, also something I like out of them so far, they're throwing their bodies around in the paint, and, and the physicality is taking its toll. And a moment now to reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. So for Chicago right now, they've got Iverson. Pippen is out there with O'Neal. Then it's Allen, and it's Whiteside in at the five. Pippen with it. He's picked up by Irving, and he gets it to go. Iverson's got the first points up on the board here in the second quarter for the Bulls. Irving kicks to Love. Mozgov sets a screen for Love. Mozgov drives in. An easy two points on the layup. And the Cavaliers lead by nine. They're finding lanes to the hoop now with consistency. Five buckets on the interior. A three ball. The offensive rebound. And the dunk by O'Neal. And gobbled up that rebound and went straight into attack mode on the putback. Oof, he, he is one of the most determined rebounders, Clark, we have got in the NBA. Yeah, you're calling it right, Kevin. I mean, he gets so many second-chance points because of how hard he works to get to the rebound. Three consecutive baskets have come right at the rim. Defense had better start buckling down and tightening up. Guys, they are getting exposed 
in terms of their low post defense. Some nice ball movement by the Bulls. And there's the three-second violation. Harry Bird's checked in for Chicago. Let's go. Cleveland leading by nine. Outside jump. Picked by Moskov. Shumpert passes to Jefferson. Outside Irving. Hits it from three-point range. Irving's got nine. He's played an important role in their offense today, guys. Without him, they may not be in the lead. Uh, Iverson dishes to Allen. O'Neal kicks to Bird. Gets it and the foul. Larry Bird finishing through contact. The number of points they've scored in the paint already today is pretty eye-opening. It, it really is, Clark. The defenders need to do a better job of closing those lanes to the hoop. And Cleveland making a change here. Della Vidova's checked in. Shumpert a screen on Allen. Picked by Mozgov. Irving passes to Love. Can't get it to go. Bird with some nice D. It's Pippen with the drive. Allen with it. Guarded now by Irving. Iverson kicks to Bird. Here's Shaq, and he bangs it home with one hand. Hey. And how about the offensive rebound with a little extra punch on the putback? You're right, Greg. As they look to trim the deficit, could we see them send a few more bodies to the board from here on out? Maybe? Just maybe? Well, I don't think it would be a bad idea, Kevin. I mean, they could use all the second-chance points they can get. Some changes for Chicago. Wade comes in for Ray Allen. And it's Johnson in for Iverson. It's a pick by Love. Irving kicks to Moskov. And it's Chicago with the rebound. Shaq's got his fifth rebound in this one. Johnson. Wade outside. O'Neal dishes to Bird. Wade outside. Open for three. The basket good off the assist from Wade. Four, three. And now it's just a four-point Cavalier lead. Talk about doing a Rip Van Winkle on defense. Come on, guys, wake up. Why are they leaving him open at the three-point line? Come on. Here's Della Vidal. Ryan so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Shepard against Pippen. Up top, Bird. T. Wade on the wing, covered by Irving. They double him with love. Shaq passes to Bird. That doesn't go either for Bird. It just hasn't been a very good day for him, guys. They need him to start burying some of those. Della Vidova kicks to Irving. Here's Love. And good. Got the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. And it's an eight-point Cavalier lead. Great assist that time by Kyrie Irving. Wade outside. Feeds it to Bird. Wade against Irving. Six on the shot clock. Wade dishes to O'Neal. And down it goes, jamming that one home. Nothing fancy there. Didn't need it. Nope. His only concern right now, Clark, is getting the points on the board, and I don't mean style points. I like the simplicity. Well, there's also style just with the fact that he's able to have that kind of a finish, though. Still, I like that pretty one-handed play. Timeout called Cleveland. Yeah, I think he just sees some things that can be improved and wants to get everybody back on the same page. And usually that, to me, is a good use of the timeout. I mean, if there's something that he's noticed that can give his team a lift, um, I think he's got to try to take advantage of that. And it's a completely new group on the floor for the Cavaliers. Then for the Bulls, Abdul-Jabbar comes in for O'Neal, and it's Jordan in for Pippen. The drive by LeBron. The pump fake kept the D off balance. He gave him room. LeBron's got five. Wow, what a pass there. He made that a very easy basket with that setup. Jordan, the pass to Abdul Jabbar. A beautiful pass that time from MJ. 
Here's Williams looking for his first basket still in this one. The dish to James. A fader. And again, it's Cleveland. Impressive, really, from that short 17 area. They are not missing many. You're exactly right. I mean, they've banged home eight of their last ten points on mid-range jumpers. Bird outside. There's the three. That falls. Nice speed that time from Dwayne Wade. Wade's got three assists now in this one. Poke loose. It's stolen by Johnson. The finish. Magic knocks it down. He shot 52% from the field in his years with the Lakers. Yeah, how about the sharp steal and then run out? It looks like they're ready to put the hammer down. Well, we've been waiting for one of these teams, Greg, to pull away. Maybe that'll be a springboard for him. Could be. A dunk like that coming off a great defensive play has to build some momentum. And you saw how quick the defense was. They were ready for him. They got the hand in the face there and made that much more difficult. Yeah, and every team needs that kind of rugged interior defense because you want to try to distract your opponents when they get inside, and you also want to make them uncomfortable in their shot attempts. Abdul-Jabbar kicks to Wade. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Bird dishes to Johnson. Down low. Here's Abdul-Jabbar. Powered down with both hands. And that's how it's done. I mean, find that <laughs> hole in the D and then go hard to the rack. Maybe that hole was a little bigger than it should have been. Well, it was. I mean, a tight game like this one, you'd think they'd have a little more energy at the defensive end than that. Picked by Verizon. James, the pass to Verizon. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket's good. He'll go to the line. Chicago making some changes. Whiteside's checked in for Bird. McGrady comes in for Dwayne Wade. And Steph Curry is subbed in for Magic Johnson. Excellent feed from Steph Curry. The Cavaliers leading. Not sure if they're aware of the two-for-one opportunity. Well, they ought to be. I mean, that's basic basketball time management. You've got to be aware of your clock and your situation. No issues on that one. Good work all around. James against Jordan. Just five to shoot. Shoots from the line. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Boy, they were ready for him right there. I mean, totally collapsed the defense on him. That is good. Now oh, it's a five-point Cavalier lead. Took advantage of some shoddy defense there. They've got to at least get a finger on it. Rising high to throw that one down. Sky high. Fantastic one-hand jam. Nice, nice way there, guys, to finish up that possession. And the first half comes to a close. The third quarter now beginning. Both sides looking to pull away in the last half of the game. Well, some really terrific numbers for Shaq. He's got 13 points and a decent little assist total for him, too. No doubt they'd like him to see that carry over to the rest of the team. Get good assist numbers all the way around. Down low, it's Love and Mozgov. Filling out the wings, it's Shumpert and LeBron. And it's Irving at the point guard position. That's the group starting the second half for David Blatt. To the paint. And there's Love. That's good on the assist by Irving. And that's now nine points for Love. Some big points there. I mean, they got him on a nice play to get the ball right to the bucket. And exactly what they're looking good from Jordan. And, and really keeping the ball hopping around here offensively. The last five trips they've had have ended with a great pass leading to a basket. They're really sharing the sugar. Irving kicks to James. Inside. Got a piece of it. Mozgov. It's blocked by Shaq. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Cavaliers will retain possession. Second half rolling along now. About a minute played here. Outside jumper. LeBron James on the wing. A second chance effort. And he gets the bucket. James has got nine. Yeah, great execution there. The turnaround, such a difficult shot to defend. 
dishes it to O'Neal. Wade outside. It's stolen by Amon Shumpert. Now Cleveland moving it up. Shumpert's running. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. Now it's a five-point Cleveland lead. And I like how he puts himself in position there to finish on the break. Yeah, you know, that's what we call seeing and feeling the game. Excellent read of how that play was going to develop and where the ball was going. That's stuff that you oftentimes can't teach, Greg. That's one he knows he should have drained. Here's Johnson. That's two unproductive trips in a row, ending in turnover. And one thing you can't do is string together those kinds of possessions. It can snowball in a hurry. Irving against Jordan. Love with the screen for Irving. Here's Mozgov. An easy layup after coming off the pit. Mozgov's got eight points. They are not rotating nearly quickly enough on defense down low. Got to get quicker there. Just no resistance on the interior. Wade dishes to Bird. Johnson outside. To the middle. Here's O'Neal. And he stuffs it. What a pass to set him up. Up high and down hard with the one hand. Got a little extra force for that one, didn't he? Yes, sir. Yeah, and I think that's going to rouse up his teammates, no doubt. James kicks to Shumper. Love with the screen on Wade. Love outside. Unloads from 13. And he gets it back. That is good. And that's now 11 points for Kyrie Irving. Third quarter here, and three minutes have come off the clock. Johnson kicks to Jordan. He feeds it to Burr. And stolen by Love. And here we go. Here's Irving. No good. So the Bulls will take it the other way. Wade outside. On the wing, Johnson. And it's wide right. Hits off the rim. This offense's first miss after three straight makes to start the second half. James sets the screen for Irving. Irving double team. It's a pick by Love. The drive by Shumpert. And the layup's good off the glass. Shumpert's got four this quarter. Really not hard to see why they're giving up points on this run. I mean, they've just given them too many looks inside. Yeah, and usually when a team goes on a run like this, it's because they are getting too many opportunities on the inside. Make them beat you from deep. Here's Irving. And basket number six to his stat sheet. He's now six for ten. Just Mr. Reliable again here today, Kevin. I mean, they need his points, and he's producing. And here is Johnson, and it's blocked. Outside Irving. Again, the Cavaliers score. All right, well, look at how the hustle game has been going for the Cavaliers. Contested shots and block shots. They're bread and butter defensively. They're giving up no easy looks. And also, the ball hockey, the way they've come up with the steals, the way they've harassed the ball handler all day, forcing mistakes, they've really done a nice job of taking advantage. Looking at who's out there now for the Cavaliers. Thompson, he's checked in for Mozgov. Jefferson comes in for Kevin Love. And Mo Williams subbed in for Shumpert. Curry can't get it to go. And here are the Cavaliers. They're on a 16-6 run. Right side, Jefferson. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. No question about it, Greg. I mean, a ton of contact and a good call by the official. And the Cavaliers making a change here. Smith has checked in. Iverson passes to Rodman. Here's Curry with the three. Another miss by Curry. And here are the Cavaliers. They're on a 17-6 run. LeBron with it. He's picked up by Whiteside. To the inside, Williams. Iverson with some nice D. Well, he won't miss many of those, especially with the defender not in the best of positions there. Shot is good, and the Cavaliers' lead cut down now to just 10 on the basket from Rodman. Now here's James. He's got nine. Outside Jefferson. Smith outside. 
And another miss by Cleveland. Bulls trail by 10 outside Curry. Passes it to Whiteside. And he takes that one up and powers it through. Threw it down with authority. Oh, he can really fly. And you combine that, Clark, with some of the nice penetration, too. And you've got an easy two points. And able to just play well above the rim. I mean, that makes this guy so dangerous when he's in the game. Smith wide open. He fired. They get the rebound. Here's Thompson. Crops in the layup for two. Thompson's got six. They have got to box out better than that. That putback's just another example of what a difference there's been between these two teams. And the jam by Whiteside. Cutting into that lead a little bit. Way to finish. And the basket is still shaking. Oh, I mean, he has got power in bunches on that two-hand. Timeout called the Cavaliers. They can't guard us on the perimeter. Spread the floor and isolate us top. Spacing, fellas. Spacing. Might as well make those adjustments right away. Matthew Delavidova has checked in for Cleveland. Tracy McGrady's checked in for Chicago. LeBron dishes to Thompson. And a wide open look for James. Will not go. This is off the front iron. One on one here. Here's Iverson. Shot on the wing. Abdul Jabbar kicks to Rodman. McGrady against Smith. The feed now to Curry. Good. And it's McGrady who picks up the assist. Curry's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. Williams kicks to James. Pass to Thompson. 44 seconds left to play here on the third. Taking it to the rack with power right there. And oh. hammering down with the two-handed slam. Just piling on the lead with the dunk like that. Iverson passes to Abdul Jabbar. Cutting into the lead with a huge one-hand throwdown. That's how to get your team back into it. Yeah, yes, sir. I, I tell you what, guys, that might also put a little spark into those guys. The screen from Thompson. That's a two from Smith. It's all in by the Bulls. And no excuse there for missing that one after being freed up by a great pick. Yeah, I agree with you. I mean, they came away empty, but they got the look they wanted, and... Really, I, I've enjoyed, I like the movement and communication there. James right side. With one on the clock. And it is good at the buzzer. Wow! And that's a big bonus for him to end the quarter as he just beats the button. And that does it for the third quarter. Both teams clicking offensively as we approach the fourth quarter. Cavaliers ahead. They lead by seven. And we'll be back right after this. And the final period of play just about to start. The Cavaliers leading by seven. On the court for the Bulls getting this fourth quarter started. They've got Michael Jordan. D-Wade out there with Steph Curry. Then there's Bird, and it's Shaq in at the center position. Back to Love. On the wing, Irving. Left side, Jumpert. Stolen by Wade. And even three-on-three -three break. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle and a lot of contact there. How about Michael Jordan? 10 points and one steal. Chicago making a switch here. Johnson's checked in, and he makes both free throws. Irving with the ball. He kicks it to James. And fouled hard that time. He'll get to the line and shoot two. Magic Johnson picks one up. 
And, and really the defense fouling there to prevent the layup, but that's exactly what you need to do. It is. I mean, no reason to back off and give him the layup. I mean, much better off making him go to the line. He hits the second from the line. Bulls trail by six. Outside Jordan. The pass to O'Neal. Back to Jordan. Lock at six. From 11 feet away, it's hauled in by LeBron. You love the close out on that possession. Excellent defense. Active, and he made it a very tough shot for him. It's as if the defenses have just given up. Yeah, you know, the pace has only picked up the deeper we've gotten into this game, which is remarkable. It speaks to the endurance and stamina of these teams, and it's also been a lot of fun to watch. Shumper dishes to Irving. Mozgov kicks to Shumper. Cleveland moving the ball around and finished off by LeBron. Oh, quick hands <laughs> on the steal and then just mad hops on the slam. Great sequence for them defensively and Clark offensively. Well, one usually leads to the other, Kevin. That's just good, aggressive, attacking basketball at both ends. And I think Doris Burke has something for us right now. Doris? Well, Kevin, I was able to listen in on what the head coach of the Chicago is saying. We're being way too soft on the inside. I'd better start to see some toughness. The Cavaliers leading by seven. Down low, here's Mozgov. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. Ten points for Timothy Mozgov. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Well, I agree with you. Four of their last five baskets have been exactly of that variety. Wade passes to O'Neal in a strong finish with two hands. Kevin, he's been a bright spot in what's otherwise been a little bit of a struggle for this team. And here are the Cavaliers. They've held a 12-point lead earlier. Oswald a screen on Johnson. James with it, and it's Johnson picking him up. Irving. And a big bounce off the rim, but it sinks right in. Irving's got 19 points. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. You know, the defense, Greg, has really been kept off balance because of the outstanding passes. Four straight field goals have been made off an assist. Third minute of action now gone here in the fourth. defense Chicago they trail by nine points and that'll be Cleveland as it goes out of bounds uh, Cavaliers retain possession you know what a low percentage pass on that one but sometimes it's worth the risk well that time the risk did not pay off because it was well defended love dishes to Moscow cannot hit good D by Jordan and it's Wade penetrating past O'Neal. And there's the whistle. Fouled hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. No question about it, Greg. I mean, a ton of contact and a good call by the officials. The first free throw is good. Oh, my God, oh it's perfect half at the free throw line for him. That'll help their comeback effort for real. And, Clark, those free throws need to continue if they're going to get back in this game. The Cavaliers leading by seven. Left side, Shumpert. Inside. And so he earns a trip to the line. Official saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. Check out the game from Moscow. Ten points and one assist. No good on the free throw. Two shots. And he can't hit the second. Bulls trail by seven. Wade with it. He's picked up by James. Jordan kicks to Shaq. And it's good assisting on the play with Jordan. Jordan's got three assists in the game. Irving passes to Love. They set the pick. He dishes it to James. Inside, there's Mozgov. It's good, and it's his sixth make against 11 attempts. 
and the crisp passing has opened things up for them offensively. Ten straight points off assist. That's very impressive, and it also makes the game easy and fun to watch. Wade dishes to O'Neal. Can't cash in from close range. The Cavaliers leading by seven. Here's Irving, and foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. That's on Dwayne Wade. No question, he got bumped on that shot. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. At the line for two. Both free throws, good from Kyrie Irving. Yeah, and what an advantage. You really feel like you can always trust him when he's at the line. Down low, here's O'Neal. And he caught that pass in full stride on his way to the big slam. That's what I like. A nice, strong finish inside. That's what he does. He's got that dunker mentality. My goodness. Physicality personified right there. Able to just go up and finish over the biggest defender. Timeout called the Cavaliers. The short rest, very important. And one of the benefits of this part of the game is getting on the same page with your team while having the chance to hydrate with Gatorade. And replenish your energy for the late game push. Wade against Irving. And he gets it to go. Irving's got 14 points now in the second half. And, and he's really made the most of his opportunities today. I mean, he needs to keep working for those kinds of looks. And the dunk by O'Neal. And really just led him to his sweet spot for that finish. The Cavaliers leading by seven. The drive by James. And the dunk to finish it off. A oh, beauty. Really, that's his specialty right there. Finding that angle and then going hard to the rim. Johnson kicks to O'Neal, and he says right back at you with a big dunk of his own. How about the excitement right now that he's playing the game with? I love it. He capped that dunk off with some serious hang time on the rim. I tell you what, he just couldn't contain himself on that one. Love with the screen on Jordan. Irving drives in. Good. Irving's got 25 points. Boy, has he put his foot on the pedal here this quarter. He's doing a terrific job in terms of leading their offense. And the dunk by O'Neal. The one-hand slam is so sweet when it's his hand doing the slam. Oh, yeah, he is so smooth, even on a power finish like that. And really, that's what makes him unique, that combination of power and polish. It's blocked by Shaq. And here we go, the Bulls. That's great. Not watching the line there. That'll be a backcourt violation. Tristan Thompson, he's checked in for Kevin Love. Cavaliers leading. Outside Irving. Kicks it to James. The baseline J. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. 16 points for LeBron. And that set them apart today, guys. Their success with the mid-range. Simply taking advantage of what the defense has given them, and they've really made the most of it. Johnson kicks the Shaq. Michael Jordan on the wing. And it's Chicago scoring again. There's a minute 47 left in the game. Now Irving. Charity stripe shot. Bird pulls it in. Bulls trail by seven. Feeds to Wade. And stolen by Kyrie Irving. The dish to James. Back to Irving. He feeds it to Thompson. Puts up the baby hook. Lands soft on the front of the rim and drops. And the Cavaliers lead by nine. And he's been the catalyst all game long. Love how he's distributing the basketball. No doubt about it, Greg. I mean, when the offense runs through him, it's really smooth. Spacing, fellas. Spacing. On the inbound, and then Wade spins it in. That was perfectly designed, Kevin. An easy dunk on that inbounds play. So it's the Cavaliers now. They've held a 12-point lead earlier. Outside Irving. Dishes to Thompson. Pass to James. Thompson sets the pick for LeBron. That one off the back iron and out. And this is why you need good defenders on the interior to contest shots. Yeah, Greg, making every shot 
a hard one. Even the shots in close. Kicked by Mozgov. LeBron James on the wing. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. And, and just a terrific job of taking care of business in front of the home fans. And Greg, those fans had a hand in the win. I mean, they gave this team a big lift throughout the game. I thought there was great energy in the building. And, and they're just raining threes on both ends. Boy, I love the answer. You come at me with the three, I'm coming right back with my own triple. So it's Cleveland winning this one. They didn't make it easy on themselves or their fans, but Clark in the end, everyone satisfied. Yeah, you know, it looked like for a moment there, the outcome was in doubt, but give them a lot of credit for hanging tough, persevering, and finishing strong. And that about wraps it up. For Clark Kellogg, Greg Anthony, and Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. Now our Jordan player of the game, Kyrie Irving.